for those is Chi David Crypto Channel, and um, hope uh, you all are doing well. All right, today I just want to show you guys uh, something. Of course, you know that the uh, coolant airdrop has ended, and coolant has has given an update. When you click on this uh, this announcement that we have here from coolant, uh, it says wallet submission for coolant tokens. The Colin airdrop on Satoshi app has ended. Thank you for participating. Please note the following important details for wallet submission to receive your tokens. Wallet submission period July 1st to July 20th, 2024. Okay, and it says here there is something I want you to see, which is the reason for this uh, video. It says core EVM address required. Make sure to submit your core wallet addresses only it says here no centralized exchange address do not use centralized exchange wallet addresses as you will not be able to receive your token are you getting it now so they are very specific about this and many of us are uh, may not know what the evm uh, address all about core evm is an evm address you know once you import on uh, the exchange you can use it to receive your your token the evm is ethereum virtual machine it is a piece of software that executes smart contracts and computes the state of the ethereum network after each new block is added to the chain it functions as the engine of the ethereum blockchain eg you have your uh your metamask yes your metamask supports evm networks like ethereum mainnet you know so trust wallet also supports ethereum network once you import your core to your metamask you can receive this colend token trade so i will just teach you how to do that i hope you have your metamask downloaded in your phone through the google play store you download register save your passphrase and uh, do the registration process so when you click on it i just want to show you how to uh, import the core evm address so that you can uh, receive your coolant airdrop so here is it so i'll just put in my password just follow me carefully so you don't do any mistake at all all right um here it is it has opened so what you do is you come to this place here where you have the browser symbol you click on it once it opens you come to you come to this place where you have the search you write this in this space. I have copied it already, so I just have to paste. So when you search for it, it's gonna take you to the core or uh, uh, the core page itself, where you'll be having the option of uh, adding your core address, your core address to your MetaMask. Once you get to the page like this, you just have to be scrolling down. So you scroll down, you scroll down, you scroll down scroll down make sure you get to the bottom once you get to the bottom of the page you come to this place come to this place where you have add core network you click on it you click on it add core network you see once you click on it it brings out something like this says this site would like to switch network so you click on switch network once you click on switch network it says success Call now active so now you come back to your normal uh, home page here just click this place come back to your normal home page once you click on it it brings you here okay so now you can see you have here once you do this you have here the call uh, address this is it here you have the call address here this is it that has been added so what are you going to do now? I've added it before actually. I'm just taking the steps again because uh, I just have to show you guys. You click on it. If you... You click on call. Once you click on call, this is the address that you're going to be submitting. This is the address you're going to be submitting for the coolant airdrop. This is the EVM call address that they, are, they were talking about. So here it is. You click on receive. You click on just copy immediately. Click on copy. Once you click on copy, 
it says public address copy to clipboard so this is how to get your uh, core evm address that is supported in order for you to be able to claim your coolant airdrop thank you very much and i hope you enjoy this video please uh, don't forget to subscribe like comment and share this video to your friends it will help them turn on the notification bell so that you can continue to get updates on our upcoming videos